Hello, welcome to Explore the Outside Water Sport. I would like to show you how to operate safely the boat and please make sure that you understand fully all the information. If you have any questions after, please feel free to ask. First of all, you can place your luggages under the sun benches in the front side. Also, this is a place where you will find all the life jackets for the whole family. Please make sure that all passengers who cannot swim well do wear life jackets. You can also place other belongings under the wheel here in this box. Where you will also find the first aid kit, all the papers of the boat and further safety equipment such as fire extinguisher, ropes and flares. Under this seat you will find the fuel. At the moment it's full tank so it will be enough for the full journey. In case you run out of fuel of course there is also a smaller tank just to refuel your uh, boat so in this case you are safe to go for all day long. Make sure you have fully understood all the information and demonstration provided by our staff. Feel free to ask any questions. Ensure you have at least one fully charged mobile phone with you. The driver of the boat is responsible for everyone's safety. Do not drink alcohol before or while driving. Kids and passengers who cannot swim well should wear life jacket. It is suggested that you carry at least one bottle of water with you on the boat. Push the boat at least one meter away from the beach. Place the kill engine or kill cord rope on your wrist. Use the power trim button to trim the engine down in the water. If the water is not deep enough, Trim the engine down until the propeller is just under the surface of the water. Make sure the gear lever is in horizontal position, neutral. If not, the engine will not start. Make certain that all passengers are seated and all your belongings are secured from falling in the water. Look around the boat to ensure there are no people swimming near the engine. If all clear, use the key to start the engine. Once the engine has started, press the safety located on the gear lever and while holding it, push the gear lever slightly forward to go in gear. Pulling the gear lever backwards will make the engine go in reverse. Be very gentle when using the gear lever since it's sensitive to movement. Once in gear, drive the boat away from the beach at a straight line at the slowest speed possible always looking around the boat for swimmers and divers. Keep going at a minimum speed until you are at least 100 meters away from the beach. Make sure there are no swimmers or boats around you and then accelerating by pushing the gear lever forward. You should accelerate gradually and steadily. The boat driver should always be aware of sea traffic conditions, depth and people swimming around. Keep a safety distance of at least 200 meters from the coast, swimmers and other motorboats when traveling. Try to pass behind other boats and not in front of them. Only use the anchor on shallow waters, 2-3 meters deep. The length of the rope release should be about 3 times the depth of your current location. The boat driver has to make sure that the anchor is safe and the engine has been turned off before anyone goes swimming in the water. Remember to have the engine turned away from the boat's ladder used by the passengers. When approaching the beach, drive the boat vertically to the beach and in a straight line. Always drive at minimum speed when closer than 100 meters to the coast, keeping a safe distance from the swimmers. When 20 meters away from the beach, Trim the engine up a little while making sure that the propeller is just under the surface of the water or you will lose control. 
10 meters from the beach, shut the engine off and trim the whole engine out of the water. The boat driver should then carefully jump outside the boat to pull it fully out on the shore. Once all passengers are out, the boat should be pulled ashore as much as possible and then be secured by placing the anchor directly on the beach, about 10 meters away. Make sure the anchor is properly put in the sand, use only two blades out of the four. The anchor blades should be facing downwards so that no one can step on them. This is all the information you need to know before you start your journey. And now you're ready to start the day. And don't forget, our world is out there. It's time to explore the outside.